Hi y'all, this is our safely sleeve bulletproof panel uh, that you can put in a backpack, a purse, a tote, a diaper bag, a briefcase, anyway. Uh, my son took it out today and um, tested it and to see how it would hold up with using nine millimeter and a 44. 45. 45, 45, okay. Anyway, so as you can see, there's holes in there. There's one here, there's one here here, down here at the bottom, and here that I can see. Now I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna turn it over, and you can see the only one that has a little hole on the other side, but it's still in there, I believe, um, or that just went through the tip of it, actually, that's what happened there. This one, we have a slit that the bullet is still in there, it did not come out, and there's a slit down here. So, my son's gonna open it up so you can see how that all happened. And then he's gonna tell you what um, round was in which hole. Okay. Alrighty. So these two right here, this one right here, and this one right here, just hold that, are all uh, nine millimeter. I also was shooting hollow point. I wasn't shooting the FMJ that says on the description that'll withstand it. So I was also trying to test to see um, how well this safety sleeve um, works with hollow points. Um, on the bottom, you can see it kind of hits where it's low, nothing too crazy. Um, you can see how I probably mushroomed it and then just tore a little bit, but nothing really stuck in there. Nothing, um, it doesn't go through a lot. Probably just tears a little bit. Um, this one right here, probably the same thing, probably just bounced, absorbed, tore a little bit in there. That round probably just, um, went right off and let's tear this for this one right here. That one right there, you can see same thing. It only goes probably a few layers of what's in here. Looks like it's stuck, actually lodged in here. So let's actually, let's see if we can get this sucker. I'd like to see how many layers it went in. Yeah. Cause none of them came out the back. No, just that corner one. Where's you this? take this out, you might be able to lift the layers off. This is only an inch, oh. a half an inch thick. There it is. Kind of looks like paper. There's the nine millimeter right here. So see, it just wow. mushroomed right there. Wow. And that's not even halfway through, nowhere near halfway. So that did its job right there. It's stuck. I can barely pull that sucker out of there. What you going to see? Gosh. It's embedded in there for sure. Yes. There we go. Look at that baby. Wow. So okay. even with that hollow point, mushroomed really well, tore a little bit, but like it only got stuck up here. It's still stuck in there. And this one on the corner right here. So that just, that only went through just because, you know, it was that corner, which is just a, tip I guess it. a good shot if you ask me. Um, but oh, you can see it that it tore. It probably mushroomed on the inside and came out the top as well and took in um, one little piece while we went out through here. And then this sucker is the um, is the 45. And that um, that's that bad boy right there. And that didn't even go all the way. That was a good solid shot to the mass of that. And it didn't even mushroom. It just kind of collapsed on in there, went opposite. But yeah, on the back side right here, you can see, I'm gonna say, this is already torn. Um, that's just kinetic energy that transferred from the bullet that caused that to tear along with the 45. So you can see the 45 didn't go through, but you know, it was carrying enough force to puncture a hole right here. So that's just gonna hurt a lot for whoever was, um, if the, whoever got impacted by it. Same thing with the uh, one right here. There's a, what is it? Oh no, that was that small nine. But um, yeah, same thing with that one. It's just, it's gonna do its job. It's gonna hold on to the, it's gonna hold on to the, um, it's gonna protect its user for the most part. I mean. See how many layers there's Nothing is even in a, yeah, there's a lot. Wow, see all that? Let's how start pulling back. Yeah, I'll do it the other way, because that's the back, yeah. So this is here. 
you can see that um, it definitely tore a little bit was I think of my knife, but yeah, it's it's definitely doing its job. It's, it's holding back. It's really absorbing that energy and not allowing its user carrier to be um, to be wounded from it, which is awesome. Wow. I don't know how many layers that is. A lot. That's hundreds. a lot. I don't think so. hundreds. 20 something, 20 something layers. That's pretty dang uh, efficient. Look at that. Yeah, to think that I hit this, what's that, five times? Oh and yeah, only... that's why it went through here because it caught the corner yeah. of it. But yeah, I think it's pretty impressive. So if you're looking for some protection for yourself, for your child, um, we have these safety sleeves. I have a special going on, buy one, get one and help off. Um, so let me know. I'd love to be able to help you out and keep you protected. Be safe. Be aware. Be prepared. Be protected.